recycling airlock. Get on with the, uh... What the hell happened? If you were a victim of the recent attack, please remain calm. You see security has everything under control. There's been an incident. Please continue going about your business. Wait. You're on the wanted list. I've got special orders. You're coming with me. Prepare for immediate transport to our vessel. Smart decision. Stand by to be transferred. Damn it, I wanted to pay off. Alright. I'm telling you, the commander's got plans for this loser. Why else would he be going through all this trouble? I still don't understand why he trusts a criminal. Seems like too much of a risk. Stop worrying and keep an eye on our guest. I'll be right back. You just sit tight. The commander wants to have a little chat. The prisoner is ready, sir. Uh, just let me pay the fine so I can get out of here. Not this time. So, let me see what we're working with here. Hm. It appears that you have a background in cyber running. Perfect. Information gathering is one of our top priorities around here. I also see that you've mined on Vectera. And now you're with Constellation. You've certainly been quite busy. Oh, and look at that. Right at the bottom of this list is the criminal incident that landed you in my crosshairs. Uh, just get to the point. I will. When I'm ready. Now that we have that out of the way, let me introduce myself. My name is Commander Kibwe Ikande, and I'm in charge of this operation for UC Sistef. Are you familiar with what we do? Uh, I honestly don't care. Yes. out of jail. So I suggest you change your attitude. UC Sistev is a division of the UC Navy. Well, they handle the big picture stuff, we deal with a very particular problem. The Crimson Fleet. That convict is where you enter the picture. Um... I have nothing to do with the Crimson Fleet. No, no, you don't. Not yet, anyway. We've been prodding at the Crimson Fleet for years, trying to take them down one ship at a time. But we barely scratch the surface. If we can get someone on the inside, we have a shot at finding a loose thread we can pull to bring it all down. That's personal. It doesn't matter how I feel. I'm simply doing what's best for the security of the United Colonies. Look, I'm going to make this simple. Agree to work for UC Sistef, and together we take down the Crimson Fleet. Refuse, and I tell these guys to throw you into the nearest lockup. Might even tack on an extra few hundred credits to your fine. Um. Okay, right. When you broke the law, you forfeited your rights. So basically, I can do whatever the hell I want. So, what do you say? You going to work with me, or should I find someone else? Come on, why not? That's fun. Smart choice. I'm 
I'm going to have one of my men escort you to the operations center. I strongly suggest that you don't give him any trouble. And don't bother trying to leave the ship. I think you'll find all access to the docking area is fully restricted. That would come. Oh, we just got a gun back, nice. Alright, let's go. Alright, yeah, what's that, Sarah? So, you took the op instead of serving the time. You gotta be the commander's new mole, huh? Going in all along, infiltrating the bugs of miners. I really don't care, that guy's. I don't. I just. I just need health. I saw Phil Gertz go really well, buddy. How are you doing today, mate? I don't know where I'm going. In a worse way to go? I know I couldn't. But I will have to it. Since the commander picked you, I'm guessing you can hold your breath for a really long time, right? Excuse me. Oh my god, I can take their fire thing. So. This is as far as I go. Take the lift up to Ops, Commander Econ. Do I not have anything that can kill me? And they should be waiting for you. A lot of campers this way. <laughs> okay. Okay. Hello. Hi. Hey. Hey. How's it going? Man, there's like no food anywhere. Hello. Food? Oh, what was that? Uh, I went down that way. I wonder. Open to the bridge. Howdy. Hey. Yes, what? Pardon. Hey.
gonna get some food chat, some healing or something. Hey. Wait, why am I going down? Here's something to get up. Oh, because I bet I'm tracking the wrong task. I am tracking the wrong task. There we go. Okay, now it makes more sense. I think that I needed to go to the bridge. Hey, can we try and focus on the matter at hand, please? No, I want to see the bridge. So none of these are the captain. So I can't. I, I guess the main guy is the captain, right? I wonder if I can join his key. Commander Ikonde owns a tight ship, so I suggest we be on our best behavior. I'd like to brief you on the mission, so please pay attention. Phoebus, asteroid. Hey. Ah, there you are. Excellent. Now that we've established your level of cooperation with us, I want to introduce you to your new home. This is the operation center of the UC Vigilance. Sysdef's nerve center dedicated to the destruction Crimson Fleet. Oh, mate. Now, how much I want to just. Huh. Which is precisely why we're taking a more clandestine approach. We need eyes and ears inside the Crimson Fleet. Someone who can feed us information, evidence and expose their weaknesses. The catch is that you can't just knock on their front door and ask for an application. Getting inside is going to take some finesse. Persuasion, get me in the room with them and I'll talk them into anything. Good. I have just the right place for you to start. Our intelligence has managed to find a possible opening into the Crimson Fleet through Sersha Bowden, one of their contacts. She works for the Trade Authority in Sidonia. So you'll be using a container of Aurora we've loaded on your ship to get her attention. Um, sounds like Bruno. You better hope so. Sersha won't be easy to dupe. Once you bluff your way into the Crimson Fleet, then the operation proceeds to evidence gathering. That's where my second-in-command, Lieutenant Gillian Toft, comes into the picture. She'll explain everything you need to know. By the way, and I get it done. You got to get going. Good. Remember, this entire operation rests on your ability to infiltrate the Crimson Fleet and bring us the evidence we need to take them down. Uh, I do my best. I wouldn't expect any less. Look, before you begin, I want to make something perfectly clear. As an undercover operative for UC Sysdev. You'll be expected to follow our code of conduct and ethics. Allow yourself to stray too far off the path, and you stand a good chance of spiraling out of control. Don't make any promises. I don't want promises. I'm just asking you to think. Anyway, it's time to hand you over to Lieutenant Toft. She'll brief you about the details of the evidence gathering portion of the operation. Now, get out of here. Good luck. 
Good luck. Why can I not pick up here? All right. We don't have a lot of time, so I need you to listen up. While you're working undercover, it's imperative that you gather as much evidence as possible. If you find any records that look suspicious or incriminating, you bring it to me. Is that understood? Found. Well, you better. Commander Akande's entire operation is resting on your shoulders. I want data slates, computer downloads, handwritten notes. Hell, I'll take anything if it'll get those bastards thrown into the brig. For the sake of the settled systems, I hope you're right. That minor skirmish you had with them on Bactera was nothing compared to the death and destruction those pirates leave behind. If you've seen what I've seen, you'd understand why I'm pushing you so hard. I'll see my fair advice. I understand why it's so important that this operation is successful. Anyway, before I let you go, there's just one more thing. Commander Akande has authorized a credit disbursement for each piece of evidence that you return. As compensation oh. for your efforts. We get moolah. It's not generous, it's motivational. Commander Akande's idea. All right, we've loaded a container of Aurora into your ship's cargo hold. We're also providing you with a sample you can use to tease the goods. We've cleared your ship for launch. Proceed to Sidonia. Make contact with Searsha Bowden. And with any luck, she'll point you to the Crimson Fleet. That should do it. You're dismissed. Thanks. We'll be here if you need us. I'm not gonna. Hello, mate. Oh, what is your gun? Oh, I can't, like... I can't pickpocket any of these guys. <laughs> Mole. I don't know about you. <laughs> you don't know me! No, I don't. But I do know the previous occupants of that interrogation chair you were sitting in. Not good people, to say the least. I think one of them even strangled a man with his teeth. Uh -oh. But if Commander Ikande says you're Sis Steph, then you are one of us. For now. You guessed it. In fact, I'd say you've got what linguistic experts call FOGO, a firm grasp of the obvious. But I'm not just any pilot. I'm the best. And I've got the kills to prove it. Uh. Don't squeeze too hard, newbie. Someone might mistake it for sarcasm. See ya. Bye. Have a great time. Up there, uh... oh, it's ship.